Hi everyone, welcome back to Drupal Academy. In today's video, we will be learning how to create a multi-step form using powerful web form module in a Drupal. Multi-step forms are great for improving user experience and organizing complex information. So let's get started. First thing, make sure you have a Drupal installed and the web form module enabled. If you have not done it, check the video which is in the suggestion in the last video i have created the simple web form also i have shared one video how to do the installation of the web form model in a drupal 10 now i will show you how to create the multi-step form for that go to structure and the web forms in the last video this is the basic form which i had created so this form looks like this Click on this view button to view the web form. So in this form, I have created these fields, first name, last name, gender, email, phone number, address and the country. So this right now this form is quite long. So we will divide this form into two steps. First in the first steps, in the first step we will add the personal details fields like first name, last name, gender, email, phone number and in the second step we will add the address and the country so for that go to our form these are the form fields now first we will add the first step for that click on this add page button in the add wizard page element give the first step name so we will add the first name as a personal details after that if you want to add the previous page button you can add so right now this is the first step so no need to add the previous button we will add the next button and what label you want to give to the next table you can add here so i will add this next and click on the save so now this one page is added now we will add the second page as well Again, click on this add page. Give the second step name as a address details. On the second step, we will require the previous button. So, we will add the label as a previous. So, no need to add the next button because this will be the last step of our form. Again, click on save. In the personal detail page, now we will add the which form fields we want to display. So drag this up and drag the fill elements you want to display inside this form as a child. Just drag this first name, last name, gender, email, and in the address detail, we will add the address and the city only. Save this form. I click on this save elements now I can go to the power form in the front end so you can see now there will be the wizard with the steps so first step is the personal details on the personal details these fields are added first name last name gender email phone number which we have mentioned here inside the personal details step and in the address we have added the address and the country these two fields so first we will fill this form with the details email phone number so this is the next button which we have added in the first step click on this now we are on the second step that is the address details so this step is highlighted again add the address details and select the country on the second step we had added the previous button click on this previous button it will redirect us to the first step again click on next it will redirect to the second step click on the submit button to save the form data so the form data is submitted and we are on the third step that is the complete step now I will show you some other extra settings of the multi-step form. 
for that click on the setting click on the form in form go to the form wizard settings if you want to link to the previous page in the progress bar for example if you are on the second step and you want to go to the first step by clicking on here only so we can achieve that using by enabling this setting second is show wizard progress pages so it will show the pages on which page you are right now and third is the show wizard progress percentage it will show the percentage of your completed form so now we have enabled these three settings i will show you those on the form save this now again go to the form refresh the form or click on this back to the form button just scroll to the form and here you can see so it is showing the number of pages like there are three steps so it is showing the now you are on the first step and the percent completion is zero percentage so we have enabled these settings from here link to the previous page in the progress bar so i will show you that first email phone number so here you can see now it is linked to the first step so it is enabled from this link to the previous page in the progress bar show wizard progress pages so these numbers are coming from after enabling this setting show wizard progress pages and the show wizard progress percentage so right now we are on the second step so it is showing the 50 percent form is completed and now we we'll submit the data so here we are getting the 100 percent and uh, pages now we are on the third page so it is showing three of three that's it from this video we have successfully created the multi-step form in a drupal using the web form module if you found this tutorial helpful don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more drupal tips and tricks if you have any suggestion or the questions leave them in the comments below thank you for watching and see you in the next video